I finally made over a thousand dollars in a month for my online side hustles and I am so excited. So in July 2023, I actually had over a thousand dollars deposited into my bank account from all of my side hustles and I'm going to be explaining which side hustles those are and I'm well at least the majority of them and hopefully this will help you out and inspire you because this was not easy and this took me a while so don't think I just did this overnight because I did not. So I started KDP in December 2021 and KDP stands for Kindle Direct Publishing and it's basically a platform that is owned by Amazon where you can publish books for free and earn royalties off of that when they sell on Amazon. So that is a very big in income stream for me. But I also started a YouTube channel in the end of January 2022 and then throughout my journey so far online. I've been working on other side hustles and all of it adds up. If you make $10 from one, it definitely still adds up. And there is a fly, I'm sorry, around my head. <laughs> there we go. Um, so in July, 2023, I actually had over $1,000 deposited into my account. So one of those income streams was KDP. So this is number one. And that income was, I believe, over $400. I think that came from my May income report. I don't have my notes on me because I'm using my phone to record and I didn't really write anything down. So we're just gonna do our best here. But I believe that income was over $400 for KDP. Now I won't be able to say the exact amounts for all of my income due to contracts and things like that. But for the ones I can, I will be sharing that. So my next income for July was YouTube and that was around $150 or something like that. Um, that's because I didn't actually reach the $100 threshold, which I still haven't met yet on YouTube in a month. And that's how much you need to make in order to cash out. But that's okay because it does roll over. So my money had rolled over and it was over $100 and I forget the exact amount, but I think it was around $150 or something like that. So that was another part of my income for July. And then I also got my very first brand deal. And this was so exciting. Like having a company actually want to partner with me was just amazing. I have reached out to companies before and I've gotten some offers before, but I am trying to be picky on what I accept and things like that. So this was just really, really awesome. They were amazing to work with. Um, very, very easy to work with. I do have that YouTube video on my channel if you want to go and check it out. But I did get my very first brand deal and by the time I got the payment and everything, it was in my bank account in July. So I'm counting all anything that went into my bank account for July is what I'm counting for this video. So it doesn't mean I technically earned it in July. Like my KDP income I earned months before, YouTube I earned months before, just all happened to be deposited in July, which is just, I'm still so excited about it. So I can't go over how much money I actually made from the brand deal, but that was another portion of the $1,000 from um, my $1,000 income for July. So my next income, which was definitely a good chunk as well, but again, I cannot go over the exact amount, was that I teamed up with Jenny Hansen Lane and we did a course together, which was, I don't know if course is the right word. We did, um, we did like a tutorial maybe, or I'll just go with course. That kind of makes more sense. Uh, and it was awesome. It was so much fun. I learned a lot and I really loved teaming up with her and everyone that joined us was super nice. I feel like it was very, very helpful. I learned a lot. I think everyone there learned a lot. So definitely a huge thank you and shout out to Jenny Hanson Lane. Go check out her YouTube channel if you haven't already. She has so much content and so much knowledge to share. So highly recommend giving her channel a look at and subscribing to her if you're interested, especially in KDP, but she does have other content as well. So anyways, we ended up splitting the profits on that, of course, or I got my portion, she got her portion. I don't wanna go too far into detail here. But that also went into the money that I got for July. So that was another source of income. And then on top of all of that, I also have other income streams. Um, and I'm not entirely sure if these actually made me money in July or sold or anything because between all of those, the KDP YouTube, the course and the brand deal, I made over $1,000 uh, in the month, I believe. So the rest of these, I'm not sure if they really um, had a huge impact, but like I said, everything adds up. 
like ten dollars a week or five dollars a month or whatever it all adds up so i also do dumb road um i did get a super before on youtube and that was super generous and super nice so thank you so much i'm not sure which month that was though so i don't know if that counts towards here but i also have an etsy shop that i just started recently and that money deposits i think a week after I also have user testing, which I'm not sure again if I got any in July, um, but I have a few others. I have buy me a coffee where people can donate money if they just want to help me out. And honestly, I probably maybe even have a few more. I have some affiliate incomes. I'm not sure again if I got those in July, but just kind of go over that as well. I kind of want to cover all my bases here, but to make over a thousand dollars a month for my online side hustles is completely life-changing I mean it's it's unbelievable to me and I'll go over again just one more time the main sources of income that got me that for July was TDP the course with Jenny Hansen Lane the brand partnership and YouTube so all of those combined are what made up majority of the thousand dollars online money that I made in July 2023 so Again, I started online side hustles in December 2021, and I started without the intention of even really doing online side hustles. I just wanted a place to publish my high content book called It's All in Your Head by Taylor Hasselton, and I, which is me, of course, and I created that, and then that's when I kind of just really wanted to deep dive into all these different side hustles. I've done a few other online businesses before, and I have had some success but I'm trying to find something that can kind of turn into passive income, which I feel like some of these can. And honestly, I've always loved YouTube and I love creating things online. So I think that's where my passion for KDP comes from because I'm not an artistic person. I'm not very creative and I really didn't know anything of what I was doing. So this has taken me over a year and a half or about a year and a half. I started I think December 24th, 2021 is when my income report starts for KDP. And then I made this money in July, 2023. So that would be a year to December, 2022, and then another six months or so to July, 2023. So about a year and a half, it took me to make this amount of money. And I am not making this consistently right now. Um, like I can tell you for like June, I did not make $1,000 in a month from these side hustles but I'm starting to kind of creep up there and it was just really cool to make that in a month. I so far have been making around $400 a month, I'd say consistently for a bit between all my income streams. I'm trying to get to $500 a month with KDP, get that up there. But I just want to make this video because I started from the very beginning too. Like I didn't have any subscribers on this YouTube channel and I wasn't making really any money with KDP or much at all. Like all of these I've had to learn and adapt and I've learned so much from YouTube. Like YouTube is such an amazing resource and a free resource to learn all these different tools. And I'm just really, really, really thankful because without all of you, like none of this would be possible. Without everyone buying my books on KDP, this wouldn't be possible. And I am, I'm just so, so grateful right now. So grateful. And it's hard to even find the words, honestly, because it still hasn't really set in for me um, being able to make four figures online like that. It's just, it's just unbelievable. And obviously, I would love if that was every month and I'd love to scale that even more. But we all start somewhere and sometimes we're going to have really great months with social media and other times we might not have great months and that's okay. This is all extra income that is truly helping me, especially right now when I'm dealing with getting laid off from my job in January and I'm currently working a contract job and um, it is nerve wracking not having a steady income right now or not knowing if my contract will be extended or not, not knowing what I'm going to be doing after that or if I'll be unemployed or, you know, there's just a lot of uncertainty. So having this extra income is truly a blessing. I'm so, so thankful. So I really hope this was helpful. I hope it was inspiring. I mean, these things definitely take time. So please don't be discouraged. I get it. I've wanted to give up before and I've doubted myself before, but I truly think being consistent does pay off and I'm working on that because it's hard to be consistent and um, I totally understand that it's not easy to do all these online side hustles. I definitely get it, especially with working 40 hours a week. I find it really hard to find time to devote to all these side hustles, but 
you know what? It's okay. Just do your best. Do what makes you happy. And I really hope this video was helpful and inspiring. So thank you so much for watching and listening. And again, I appreciate everything that all of you guys do for me because I, it's just amazing. I truly, truly appreciate it. Have a great day.